Hi there, I am all out of carrot juice. Come over and make me some carrot juice. Um, this video is about electricity and frequency. Um, this is not a Chinese um, puzzle. It's um, steel electrode. This one is from the Ken Presner Ultimate Zapper. This is what it looks like. Mm, this guy here. Okay, these are the uh, leads. So you attach mm, the alligator clip here to this one, and the other other alligator clip to the other one. Then you take a damp paper towel and wrap a single wrap around your ultimate zapper and then grab on to the electrodes and you don't have to plug it into the wall because this has got batteries and um, then you just uh, switch it on that red light will come on now Ken Presner on his website recommends mm, like a short time uh, the reason for wet paper towel is to increase the electrical frequency conductivity and also to prevent the metal ions from seeping into your skin. Um, I've been using a wheelchair a lot so I figure I got a lot of metal that I'm pushing into my skin anyways at this point but regardless um, I don't really feel a dang thing and I had it checked out to see if it's actually sending a, a square wave and my friend Jonathan um, he checked it out and said yeah it's running I think he said 14 volts he makes a, his own square wave zapper based on the Hilda Clark model and um, felt his was more powerful because it ran a different frequency it was also a square wave zapper all right so uh, I heard about Ken Presner online um, in his presentation to the MS Society he slammed them at a conference in um, all right, I'm going to shut this up. He slammed them at a conference in um, Vancouver, BC, saying, hey, um, you guys are not talking about mercury. You're not talking about parasites. And he uh, did some mercury removal and did some chelation, and he did some parasite zapping, and he's on his feet and doing well. Um, so this is one of the technologies I wanted to try. I've tried it a few times. I haven't really noticed any Herxheimer effect. Um, not really consistent with it so um, I'm making this video bug me about it and I'll be more consistent and um, so that's uh, that's one method of um, hitting the, uh, the parasites now the idea behind the uh, these frequency generators square wave zappers is that um, parasites live in a certain frequency and when you you push that frequency at them they just explode so the it's like taking um, a wine glass and running your fingertip over it you get that that vibration when you run the right frequency and the right tempo or when an opera singer hits the right pitch that glass shatters um, same thing uh, it's based on ideas from Hold the Quark and probably ideas from Royal Rife and the rifing of parasites um, so I got into uh, researching some of the parasite zappers the rife machines well the um, dug coil is a fairly large and heavy coil it looks like my daughter's home um, so I'm going to shut this off but this is a frequency generator uh, look up spooky 2 it's free software this unit uh, about a hundred bucks for this unit so compared to a uh, dug coil device which is several thousand by We'll talk to you soon. Gotta go, daughters here. Shh.